friends, new problems. John, we got a telegram from some lady friend of yours, a Bonnie something or other. Something you ain't telling me? Bonnie McFarlane. She's a friend. Mm. Saved my life when I went after Bill and nearly got myself I gave her the old again. drip. Oh, now you two's in the habit of sending each other letters. How very nice. Bonnie, what you what doing, dude? You blowing that? it up for me, bro? What's it say? Letting my wife see that I'm talking to you? I can't. Well, you know I can't read. Give it here. It says, John Marston, you our platonic relationship is the best thing I've ever had. I absolutely do not dream of you naked at night. Dear Mr. Signed, Marston, uh, Bonnie McFarland. Need corn sacks. Stop. Emergency. Stop. Corn sacks. Weevils and moths ate entire county supply. Stop. Can you help? Not exactly the most romantic request, now is it? I guess not. She saved your life, you say? Yes, ma'am. Well, then you're gonna have to help her and her family out. We've got a plentiful supply of corn sacks over near the silo. I feel like corn sacks is a euphemism. Uncle didn't manage to have stolen while we was gone. Okay. Hurry back, John. And John, what's she like? Oh, uh, you know. She's ugly. A little bit like you, That's I guess. That's the only answer. She's ugly, annoying, and I hate her. Man's world. <sighs> she smells bad, too. John, wait! I changed my mind. I'm coming with you. Smart move. What are you waiting for? We better hurry. Why is it timed? I don't think I can let you go off again without me. Fair enough. I'm glad of the company. You only had to ask. Ask? I was waiting for you to ask me. I thought you'd want to keep an eye on the boy. Oh, while well, you were off cavorting with cowgirls in the next county? I don't think so, John Marston. You only just got home. That Jack has seen enough of me for a lifetime. So, did she marry? No, so you smelled her? Yeah, you're right. That's what would happen. No. What does she look like? I don't know. Pretty normal, I suppose. Normal? What? Normal like me? No. Normal as in two eyes. John, you're failing, dude. No, that kind of normal. Besides, ain't no woman fine as you. A little flattery. Now we're finally getting somewhere. If you find yourself in a hole, the first thing to do is stop digging. Another pearl of wisdom from John Marston. I sure do miss those. I never took you for the jealous type, Abigail. I ain't jealous so much as curious. You heard what she wrote. It's just some corn. She saved my life, and she was decent enough to me, so I owe her this much at least. Code always gets dark and scary at Thieves Landing. I bounce off the walls like Mario Kart. Found me half dead on the side of the road and took me to the doctor. Most folks would have left me there. Half dead from what? Bill didn't take so kindly to me visiting on him now. Bill never did like surprises. How was he? Same as he was when we left. Angry and dumb. Taking his revenge out on the world. People down there was really scared of him. Of Bill? You gotta be kidding me. He was only frightening if he I know, was wouldn't that be hilarious if that lantern killed me? So bad. That honestly went through my Dad mind. Went crazy. Bill took it hard. For a while, we all thought we'd found something right. Better way to live, but it was just a lie. So you saw before they did. Maybe. But they was still kind of a family. A family that left you for dead. You knew the truth, John. And they hated you for it. Where did they take you? Who? Those government bastards. Where did they hold you and Jack? I ain't sure. They kept their eyes covered there and back. Can't have been too far from here, though. They treat you right? It ain't the first time I've had a gun to my head, John. You're forgetting your marriage proposal. Very that sounds lovely. Funny. No, they learned pretty quick what would happen if they laid a finger on me. Sons of bitches. It wasn't them or being there. I didn't care about that. I've been in far worse situations. Cool. You came. Thank you so much. We lost the entire harvest. Miss McFarland, I'd like you to meet my wife, Abigail. My wife. Oh, you quite the gentleman all of a sudden. It's a pleasure to meet you, Mrs. Marston. Likewise. Thank you for saving my husband's life. Doesn't get on off the off the wagon. Manners, 
making her look up to her. I didn't teach him anything. I know better than to try to change a man. You should meet my father. Oh, people can change, Miss McFarlane. John and I have to believe that more than anybody. This is a decent first harvest for you, John. You should be proud. That's good land. Yeah, you should be proud. That's good land you got there, John. Congratulations. How are you feeling, Mrs. Marston? From what your husband told me, it must have been awful for you. I've been through worse, and I knew he'd be back before too long. He can't cook a meal to save his life. Abigail, in my darkest hours, when I was most homesick, just the thought of one of your rat meat stews kept me pushing forward. <laughs> well, about as amusing as a weeping saddle sore, ain't he, Mr. Farlin? If you're gonna start yammering about women's work, John, I'd say you might be in the wrong company. I'd say so, too. I never felt so outnumbered. No wonder John can uh, handle all those dudes, because, like, his wife is scary. He's like, oh, I gotta shoot 50 dudes? Ah, no big deal. At least I don't have to eat my wife's cooking today. There's her hopes and dreams. This is all she hears right now. <laughs> Baby crying. Ma'am? She hoped my wife was fake. I did too, Chad. I did too. Although Abigail's pretty nice. But you know what's nicer than Abigail? Abigail and Bonnie. Go algebra with it, do. A B. The perfect rancher's wife. A B C one thing. Got a, you know? got a big bed. That's all I'm saying. Season. I like her, and I'm glad she saved your life most of the time. Anyway. The McFarlands are good. People. Abigail, Bonnie, and Johnny. Yeah, dude. Than a sunset when she saw you, I, I say Johnny. <laughs> I don't know why. Yeah, I don't know why to his name. One too many blows to the head. You ain't wrong about that, Mrs. Marston. My name's Johnny now. Call me it. That's quite a ranch they got there. That'll be us someday. As soon as we get back on our feet. I don't know, John. How many times can we start again? An outlaw and a working girl. We ain't exactly farmers. We are now. Forget that life. It's over. Do you really believe that? We have to. It's the only way we'll ever have a future. The life we led, that doesn't go away. Never over. You think those government men are just gonna leave us alone now? The old gang's dead. I did what they asked. And that's it? A life of crime for killing? We're back together, ain't we? Until they decide you owe them something else. Sometimes I think I was the stupid one for believing I could get out. Maybe Dutch, Bill, and Javier were just being honest with themselves. You ain't perfect, John, and I sure ain't. But you're better than they are, than they were. Maybe we can't change. We gotta try, for Jack's sake. Even if we Just have to bounce. start again a hundred times. It's better than going back to what we were. How's Jack doing? Angry, upset. He's been through a lot. I hope he's gonna be all right. It's gonna take time. For a while, his world was safe. Normal, even. Then it got turned upside down again. He ain't saying much about it. I've tried to talk to him. I know, dude. I'm like Tony Hawk of what wagon he driving. When he asked about Uncle Bill and Uncle Dutch. They were his family when he was a little boy. He hides away in those books of his. Wouldn't you? It ain't like the real world's done him many favors. He's just been kidnapped. He grew up with the gang. That's no lie for a boy. We did our best to protect him. Come on, John. He saw things no boy should see. Well, now we got a chance to make it right. I'll go pick him up, Playboy. That's what a 16-year-old wants. Right, chat? Boobs. Oh, thank you, Abigail. We did good today, No, that's what we want. We're past the boob stage. We know what we want lead. now. We're old enough.
What's the U? Is that for that uncle with the pea soup in his beard? All right, chat. Um, I want to do the Johnny missions later, so I just finished the Abigail one. So now I got to go fight a bear with a knife. Make sure I have a lot of medicine. Okay. Seven more left? Is that how many I got? Okay. Go. Let's go kill a bear with a knife. I don't know how this game will end, but I'm a little sad. I'll donate $5 for me to finish today if I have to. Okay, well, I'm going to take another 12 hours. Um, no, but I'm a, I'm a little sad. Uh, I'm a little sad that Red Dead isn't about Jack. Like, that would be kind of cool. Like, I know it would leave the Western setting, and so that's why it wouldn't work, but I'm a tiny bit sad about that. Sorry, Sheriff! Uh, sorry, Sheriff! Let's see if I can hack the game. If this dude helps me damage the bear. No! 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 Sheriff just got killed by a bear. It's the equivalent of going to a movie. Alright, maybe I'll, I can finish it. Just want to try to kill a bear real quick. I thought I could be easy. And there was my one bear right there. I was hoping I could hack it by like, does a throwing knife work? No, it says your melee knife. It does. It says that. All right, wolves. Did the Gerald Rivia down the stick. I feel like there's another wolf around here. Am I dead? I'm dead, aren't I? <laughs> Finally gets to see his his bear his his family back dies by a bear. Yeah. If that wolf wasn't there, I would have got him, dude. So many things just went wrong there. The game did not want me to do that. It's like, oh, let's put a sheriff here who's going to shoot the bear. Okay, that bear is dead. Oh, now let's throw some wolves in there, too. And by the way, the wolves and the bear love each other. They totally don't want to fight. They totally don't want to fight. This should be so simple, chat. Like, one bear... Melee knife, and that's all it should take. Let's go. You get a bear onesie if you do this challenge? Dude, that would be sweet. Walk around with my bear skin. People would finally give me the respect I deserve. Come on. The thing is, I'm pretty far away on Master Hunter, which is why I want to make some progress on it. I need to get to a place where there's just one bear. Come on. Like, see, there's 6,000 wolves right there. You see him? Oh. 
Just shot my horse in the head. Here we go, chat. Come on, bear. You scared? Are you scaredy bear? Are you scaredy bear? Are you kidding me? John, quit being an idiot! Slice the bear! I think death is the worst or the least of the problems for that horse because I also shot him in the head. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Great, I'm doing the slow thing too. Perfect. Love it. kidding me right now, dude? This is when you come get me? Smart. That's actually smart, bear. It's actually smart. Let's go, bear. Dude, this is rigged, all right? This is rigged. Like, the bear just runs around like a, like a wacko. Well, it says just my melee knife. I don't think I can shoot it to weaken it. Like, kill a bear with your melee knife and collect a bear pelt. Lasso the bear? <laughs> I don't think you can do that. Like, does that, does that really mean I can shoot it first? I feel like that's cheating. I feel like they would not allow that. Why is my horse all the way over here in Timbuktu? Come on. You just have to kill it with the... Okay. All right, well, I'll try that. Okay, I'll try it. I mean, that would certainly make it easier. It's really more about the wolves coming in and ruining my day. So yeah, I want to make sure these two weren't bad first, but they are also bad, so. Just take care of them as well, I guess. So dudes out here in the Colorado countryside just shooting anybody who comes by. All right, that's nice. All right, now I need to find me a bear. The 
This should be easy. Usually the bears find me. Like this right here? This is bear country. Alright. I hear also hear wolves. Let's go. No, horse. Horse, you are a special kind of idiot, aren't you? Skyrim down the mountain works perfect. All right, there's a bear. I see him. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. This bear's taking a poop. Now, did the bear run away? Oh, here comes another one, though, chat. We're good. Okay, so two shots with that will kill a bear. All right, that's good to know. I think it's probably because I shot him in the head, though. Hey, welcome back. H how was school today, my man? I know there's a bear just going to rush at me. I'm just waiting for it. God, my horse, dude. My horse is so loud. Come on, bears. I know you travel at three. What did you miss? Nothing. I don't know, chat. What did he miss? Like, the part where I got my family back? I've done the Abigail missions. Everything but the end missions. Okay, that's a good way to sum it up. And now I'm trying to knife a bear. Okay, I'm going to kill him, and then I'm going to kill this bear... And then I'm going to wound this one. I'm getting good at this. Yeah, I have to kill a dog. I feel kind of bad about that. This is the one I shot a lot, too. Like, he should be super weak. Why do they run away? Running away, bear? Like, and I can't hit them when they're running, either. Like, I have to, like, cut them off when they turn. Lasso? Does the lasso really work? Like, I mean, it slows them down, but I... He's going to hit me on the ground. I'm going to die. John. Did it, dude. See? It, I don't think it counted. It, it, did, it didn't count because I, I damaged him with bullets. Oh, I have to click this pelt. Never mind. Sorry, dudes. Chat, you were right. I was wrong. I bow down to your awesome smartness. Last still.
Nice. All right. Yep, here we go. Now I got to do these. These will be these will be fun to do. Okay, so here's what we're going to do now. We're going to go do we're going to go do the uncle missions. So do uncle. Oh my god, you know what I forgot I gotta do today, guys? I've gotta make my Destiny video. Today is Tuesday. And I have to do my Where is Cade's Chess video. I just remembered I have to do that today. I've been so wrapped up in, uh, in this game. Hey, Abigail, how's it doing? How are you? That's the door I was looking for. I gotta go in here. In here. Save it. All is forgiven if you have Red Dead. Red Dead Redemption don't give me my YouTube views. I've got, I've got to do it. I'll do it here. I'll do it later. I won't do it on stream, so you guys don't have to worry. Okay, what time is it right now? Is that night? Is it? Maybe it's raining out. What is that? North? So that's east? Yeah, okay, it's sunrise then. No. Yeah, sunrise. Okay. What, what's my problem? I can't do uncle right now. It's too early. Okay, we'll do this Jack mission then. We'll do the Jack mission. Hello, sir. He's been pretty normal. Like, it's just like, hang out with your kid or take your wife into town, you know? Yeah, he's asleep right now. What's the book, boy? He passed out. Uh, nothing, sir. What's it about? Well, it's an adventure, sir. Um, set out in the West, and it tells this amazing story of how people killed the savage Redskins, and how this man, this brave man, hunts the man who killed his father. I'm glad you're enjoying it. Talking of adventure, how'd you like to learn to track elk? Really big ones in the valley this time of year. What you do is you press start. Use the meat. You hit map. Map. Well, you look I, for the picture of the elk. You'd rather read place the marker. Trust me, this can be very enjoyable in its own way. I suppose maybe it's a little less dramatic. So, let's go. Come on. You may get to see me get gored by some massive wild beast. Then you can write a story about that. Very funny, Paul. I've forgotten how funny he was. Yeah, he's got great jokes. Thanks. He's got great jokes. Mount your horse. Jack, you need to learn how to whistle for your horse. It's a real dad joke stream with John Marston. Yeah, for sure. He's, he's a dad. Dad jokes are All on right. point. Now stay close to the dog, son. Call your dog Rufus. Great dog name. When he finds something, you stay back and I'll show you how to make a kill. Whatever you say, sir. You sure you're ready for this? I guess so. I mean, he didn't want to come, John. Now the trick to hunting is calm and patience. You gotta think and move like an animal to catch an animal. A rifle helps, doesn't it? Elk don't stand still, son. I wouldn't know. This is the first time you've taken me, hunt. There's lots of things I ain't done with you, but I'm gonna try and make up for that. Let's go! You don't seem too excited about this. 
What do you want me to say, huh? Yippee! You sure you're all right? I mean, I know all that business must have been hard on you. It wasn't nothing. I'm not a kid anymore. Well, it won't happen again. It's over. Until the next time hey. you meet. Hey, don't be a Jack, turd, son. I'll smack your face off. There won't be a next time. Don't make no more promises, Paul. I've heard them all before. John and Jack need a family show. You know, one time I hunted elk with up the Marshalls. Trees. You never seen a bigger animal in all your life. I read this story about a girl who was raised by wolves, and she'd hunt goats with them and everything. That sounds like a tall yarn to me. Taller than a boy being taken from his home and locked up in a dungeon. I'm just saying. Maybe you spend too much time with your head in those books. Dude, you just got you just got Look, wrecked by your one. son, dude. Yeah, I see it. This one's mine. Stay with me, son. I don't see it. Do you guys see it? Come on! This is how you kill an elk, son. <laughs> Gotta make sure it's dead. It's dead, son. Come on. I'll show you how to cut the meat. Make sure you say something witty like, What did I you thought eat? I was going to get away. That was great, Paul. Huh? What have you been eating? Nice shot. Not rushing. Woo! That's a big one. This meat should fetch a decent price in Manzanita. Ooh, Hope Manzanita. Watching. It'll be your turn next. What are you doing? Let's keep moving. Hey, would you shut your lips, son? All right. Let's see if we can find My horse more. wanders off like an Where idiot. Come on. Unless I need him to be close, and then he's... I mean, unless I want him to be far away, and then he's literally in my butt. You ready to take a shot, Jack? Of course, Paul. Remember, it's We're going to run into time. a bear or a cougar Wait or something. Wait for your moment. Don't snatch it. I know. I saw how you did it. This clearing is the perfect place for elk. By the way. What have you found, Rufus? Come on, boy. Find us something. Found a bear. Go Whoa. find him, Rufus. Look, they're over there. Why do I have to shoot him? I thought my son was supposed to shoot him. Don't rush him. Whoa there. That's it, son. You saw how I cut the meat, Jack. Now it's your turn. Yeah, cut the one you shot, too. Say something hilarious like, you stink! Any day. Any day, John. Stab! Ew, 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 grody. Oh, nasty. Ooh. You gotta do some slicing. I've seen that like a hundred times. Oh, he gave up. Nice oh, work, Nope, son. he got it. Okay. Good he just work. has to do a lot less work than me. Now, come on. Let's get this meat over to the trading post at Manzanita. Did you see me? You did good, son. Only kill what you need. We'll go out again soon. That's why I killed two other elk. I didn't think I was gonna like it. I told you you'd have fun, didn't I? That's why I killed three elk and we only that's why I killed four elk and we only skinned two. Only kill what you need, son. Except for those elk over there. They talk dirty about Abigail. Let's kill them. Only kill what you need has nearly wiped out the entire animal population in the West. Yup. 
There are no more grizzly bears in Colorado. Hardly any buffalo in America and Kansas. There's plenty of skunks. I'll tell you that. Now I own a I own a horse uh, house here, son. All right, here we are. Jack, you wait here. I'll be just a moment. Well, howdy. Howdy. Hey, mister. Oh, well, let's see what we can do for you. Um, I need I to sell elk meat. Girl the other day. Uh, I've got nine of them. I'll sell seven. Oh, well. I'll sell eight. Okay. You're all set. Howdy. That's all of it, sir. Best be going. Okay, then. I like how they're teaching me this now like I didn't know before. What? I sold it. What else do I have to do? Sell elk meat at the store. I guess I have to sell it all. I guess I have to sell it all. What do you have? Thank you. Yeah, that's gotta be it. Well, that's all I got will be running even faster. Yep, I had to sell it all. All done. Let's head home. Uh, hello there, Mr. Marston. Jack, you just ran into a bunch of horses, dude. Easy. How much did you make? Never you mind. Enough to keep Rufus out of the stewing pot for a couple of days. And what about me? What do I get? You get to eat, son. But I did have to work. That ain't fair. What can I say? I'm another corrupt landowner. <laughs> Got him. He didn't do half the work. All right, I I'll shot three of them. One day, then you'll see. I sure hope so. And you can look after us when we get old. What do you mean, get old? You are old. Oh, we ain't wreck, old. dude. Uncle's old. Well, he should be in a museum. Yeah, preserved in whiskey for the next thousand years. Come on. Come on. Oh, good. He so, rides as fast as me. You enjoy your first hunting trip? It was great, Paul. Herding cows, hunting elk, growing up. Proud of it. I always told you I wanted to help. You know, you and me, we work hard. We can make something of this farm. I'd like that. And thank you for looking after your mother. She said you were very brave. I tried to be strong, like you told me. But Ma, uh, she can look after herself. She soon put those fellas in their place. I can only imagine. There you go. Oh, Pa, that was so much fun. I can't rightly believe it. Just like in the books. We'll do it again soon. Now get to your chores. Spending some quality family time there, chat. Rufus, you good dog, you. Okay, Jack. You discovered the bur bureau uniform will make you immune to all law enforcement. Wolves, dogs, and so oh, great wolves, my favorite. Hey, remember when I told you to do all those chores, Jack? L O L. Tense enough. I'm not. You are. Your back's tense and it's making the rifle jump. You're holding it wrong. Here, let me show you. I don't need you to show me, Paul. I think you do. You're doing it terrible. Don't show me and you'll just, you'll just run off again or something. It's better I teach myself. It's your favorite uniform? I'll try it on. I don't know how to change clothes over. here yet, but I'll try it on. Somewhere. Whatever you say, Paul. Don't be like that. Sorry. Jack, I'm gonna put you in the corn pen and throw dynamite at it. Wolf's been after the herd. Gotta get out there and scare him off. You wanna come with me? Safer with two. Okay. Yep, good one, horse. Alright, let's go. Stay on Rufus now. <laughs> Miss the dynamite oh. show? Come on! didn't happen. I don't know what you guys are talking about. I 
can shoot. You know that. Why you gotta treat me like a kid? It's what fathers do. I'm just trying to look out for you. You can't just decide to be a father when it suits you. What about the rest of the time? Come on, Jack. That ain't exactly fair. Don't give up now. Let's keep moving. Dude, I was waiting on Rufus, son. you me to be a man, the next you tell me I'm just a boy. It's gonna take a while for things to get back to normal. Normal? Was it ever normal? I don't know. But it'll get better, son. I promise. Oh, there. I'm sorry, Paul. You don't need to be. I don't mean to be moody. I'm glad you're home. I, I really am. It's just every time you go off, well, I worry you're not coming back. I swear, if it was down to me, I'd never have gone anywhere. You're going to land us both in the dirt. It's complicated, but it seems they can't. Jack needs to get hit. Dude, he's a little whiny, dude. What was your father like? I didn't really know him. He died when I was just a boy. Died of what? Why do you want to know? Come on. He's picked up a scent. Easy. He's Don't picked up a scent. And he just stands there. Come on. He died already. Jack. No, nah, he's being a jerk. You know who else has been through a lot? John Marston. At least I sincerely hope not. He's probably lost a people's father, though. Well, why do you call him Uncle Ben? Folks always did. Probably because he's always been older than everybody else. He was old when I was a kid. He was old when I was a kid, son. <laughs> God must have had some purpose for keeping him on this earth. Come on, we can't yeah. stop now. I sure as hell don't know what that is. That's a good boy. He's found him. Go. Gladly. John has eyes like an eagle. Yeah, I don't know how he saw through this uh, this giant hill. Jack, you took too long. Come on! Don't let him get too close! You can't be tired already! Come, on. Come here, wolf! Got him, chat. Son can't shoot standing still, better make him shoot on horseback against on. deadly animals. We can't stop now. You know what? That is a pretty good plot hole there, isn't it? Alright, we should head back now. We got out further than I thought. Come on, boss. How many do we Oh. Jack, would you hurry it up, son? Oh, can I ask you something? Of course. Were you a murderer? Yep. What? That place where they held us. I shouted at a guard one time, and he yelled that you were a murderer. Maybe. But I live my life believing there's a difference between killing and murdering. Not for the person who's dead. No. And I guess I've been both. That's how it goes. 
We all do what we have to to survive. Sometimes it ain't pretty. Maybe tell him that it was wrong. We pay the price for what we you know. Did. Maybe like murdering is wrong. Exactly. Look, when I was a kid, things were different. Rules were different, but that's over now. Maybe like killing is wrong. Killing is badong. It's bad wrong. All we did was kill a few wolves. Well, I read a book about a father and son who banks. Yeah, let's do it. That was his name. I'm happy with my two arms, if you don't mind. Just imagine it, though. John and Jack Marston, those wanted men in the West. And what about your mom? Well, I mean, we still come home. You live in a dream world. Are you coming or not? Let's go. Well, there's subtitles. Rufus, you are a very loud dog. Let's go. Jack took forever. Bye. Uh, he's got stamina like you wouldn't believe, too. Jack, hurry it up, man. Oh, you magically appeared. You turned into a decent hunter, son. But try to stay out of trouble. All he does is read books. How much trouble could he get in? Doesn't even look like he goes to school. All right, let's do the uncle mission. Your family member is not here right now. Check back later. Well, there he is. Just wandering around. Uncle, get over to your post. Uncle, get over there. By sweat and toil. I like how the epilogue is just me ranching. Like... <laughs> He's like, our generation can't do 90% of what our parents can do, but we sure do love our video games. Exactly. I can hunt elk. What are you saying, dude? You saying I can't? You saying I can't hunt wolves? That's right. Get up, old man. I, I am up. Dude, just let the old man sleep. Get up. I'm not paying him or nothing. Oh. Oh. There, I'm up. Thank the good Lord you're back. Nothing Your dad has legit so he goes and sleeping in the blind. warm afternoon sun. Skills are just different nowadays, all right? Like, I can't fix cars like my dad, but my dad couldn't do this. That doesn't make his skills any more impressive than mine. It's just a different world, man. John Marston. You always was a useless, conniving thief. In my opinion. And where's them cattle? Did you take them to pasture? It's coming around to that. When exactly? It's easy to pick on the elderly. God, what is with his it's beard? It's easy, but it ain't dignified. Come on, old man. Do this together. Like, he needs to clean his beard, chat. He needs to clean that beard now. You gotta be hurting, okay? Yep, that's what I wanted to do. Dude, I don't want to imagine that, Ren. What is wrong with you? Yeah. Gardening, building houses. Yeah, I mean, that'd be cool. I agree. But you can have other skills. You don't need to know how to do everything, man. And you can learn those things if you want. I mean, maybe. I don't know. It's like Colby and its Let's woodworking thing. Out. Can you really learn new skills? I mean, I guess you could, but you'd have Go. to give up other things you want to learn, you know? Okay, there's one cow that's an idiot. I'm watching you, cow. Come on, let's get him out to pasture. Come on, come on. I know how to game, that's about it. You know, be proud of what you are, my man. That's all I gotta say. It's good to have goals, but it's not good to, like, uh, go. it's not good to feel bad about only, yeah. you know, about what you've achieved so far, you know. Get to moving, cows. I 
Like, you can have hopes and dreams, but don't feel bad about not achieving them. You know, just work towards them a little bit. And it's probably good to only have one or two. Okay, look at this jerk. Cow? Get over there. Get! I, I, there's just a rock, and it just splits the entire herd. Get to going. Like, I feel like we're going the exact opposite way as well. What's this chest right here, chat? There's a loot, dude. Zip your lip. Yeah. You want to be a voice actor so bad? I mean, there's websites for that, man. Like, you can easily, like, put your auditions and stuff on a website. My friend Cameron does that. He made a lot of money as a voice actor until he decided to have a baby, and then he had to get a real job. Hey, right, he did it all online. Like, I think it's Voices.com or something. Old man, listen to me. I will throw you into a combine. One cow. Get! Get to moving. Get to moving. What the hell? Oh, are they all stampeding again? Oh, they stampeding towards the train? Hey, stop. Yeah! Stay with our herd. Come on. I'm done with the outlaw business. All right, it's their problem now. Damn, maybe you have changed. Cow, get to moving. Dude, voice acting would be fun. That would be fun. Yeah, there's definitely websites out there, man. Just Google. All right. Because I, I know, because Cameron, man, he was a—he's a voice actor. Well, he was. I mean, I think—I mean, he still is. You know, he's not working as it right now because he's—he had to make more consistent money for his baby. But yeah, man. I mean, I don't think it's—if you got the talent, you know, just keep trying. Come on. Yeah. Talent and work ethic, dude, and work ethic will make up for for talent, in my opinion. You got to have some natural talent, obviously, but I mean, that's something you you can work at too. Trying to do better. Classes, YouTube, that type of stuff, man. Follow your dreams. How did I lose three cows? Come on. I guess I just lost some cows. Big deal. You look after the herd. I'll ride back. No thanks. You got your pound of flesh from me today. Yeah, I mean, as long as you're working on it, that's all that matters, dude. I'm right, gonna head back to Uncle over here. Yeah, just keep working on it, dude. I mean, recognizing where you're, recognizing where you have issues is a big step in working towards it too. So, just don't be too hard on yourself. You keep doing better, and I mean, that's all it takes. Come on. Don't just. These things take time, like years, dude. Everything, everything you want to be good at, takes a long time. Nothing happens over over a, over a night or a week or a month. True, twenty-eight. Tur, 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 tur. old man. There's some mustangs and some such out there beyond that ridge. Wondering if it was worth getting you and going around some of them up. Fair enough. We're nearly out of money. Ranch is in turmoil. I go play Liar's Dice. We may not make it through the winter. What could we possibly want with some good quality horses? Come on. <laughs> that tone of voice ain't so becoming on you. <laughs> Makes you seem all 
pent up and angry like some Blackwater would-be business tycoon with a bad case of hemorrhoids. You got a bad case of hemorrhoids on your I'll beard, you brother. I'll you a bad case of someone just shot me in the head if you don't hurry up. Are you gonna mount up, kid? Yeah, like a thousand dollars is a lot of money, remember? My co's name is just Uncle. This coyote just right outside my house. Just not even gonna worry about a coyote in my land. All the damn time. What happened to you? What were you gonna do? Just look at them horses all day? Well, God forbid I'd do anything around here without checking with His Royal Highness first. Yeah, you're real good at watching. That's about all you're good for, apart from bending your elbow. I can't do right for doing wrong. You're an ungrateful bastard, you know. I did my best when you was gone. You did terrible, Your best dude. Is like anybody else's work. Yeah. Come on. I'm getting old. I gotta start taking things easy. You've been taking things easy for 40 years. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah. I see him. Missouri? Dude, they went a million miles away, dude. Good one, John. You got him. Let's get this white one right here. Oh, got him, John. Good job. My horse sucks. Look at these horses outrun me. Yep, John, perfect. You got him. You taught him a lesson, dude. John, you are the worst. more that goes into horse breaking than just staying on the back of a horse for a, until it gives up. It's just like, this is my life now. Would you, would you get, would you stop it? There we go. Running off. If you got one more left in you, go throw the damn rope. Deal now. He's right there. Got him, John. Good job. Good, I got my white one. Come on, come on, come on. Show it who's boss. Nearly 
Thank you, goodness gracious. There you go. Come on. Whoa, there. She's a beauty. I think that's enough for now. Let's get him back to the ranch. Let's go. That weren't half bad for a couple of old reprobates. I learned a few things while I was away. Anything you wanted to know, you only had to ask. You? How about clean what your the beard? Hell do you know about any of this? I was a rancher myself back in the day. Firstly, I don't believe you. And secondly, we'll never know what secondly was, chat. We'll never know what secondly was. Make sure there's enough fresh hay. We need to keep them strong. All right. Damn, a little gratitude wouldn't kill you. Thanks. Not a bad day's work. Hundred bucks. Now I have almost two thousand dollars, chat. One point three K, try two K. All right, we got Jack over here now. Abigail's just wandering around. Let's do this Jack mission. Hey guys, it's me, Z Swigs. Thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you found it interesting, informative, and most of all, entertaining. Please leave a comment, let me know what you thought, and hit that thumbs up button and subscribe to the channel. Also, come hang out with me every day over at twitch.tv slash zswigs. We're playing fun games over there. I love all of you, and thanks again for all your support.